DC brushless motors are used in a wide variety of applications. And because these systems are things we use on a daily basis, it's important to make sure that we analyze and identify critical issues within our design to leave no room for errors. In this example, we'll first take a look at how an ideal DC motor circuit performs using MATLAB Simulink. We've set the target rotational goal as 50, and the results of the co-simulation show that the speed initializes and stabilizes at 50 as well. While these results are as expected, we're interested in seeing how the motor will perform in the real world. I've already made some adjustments to the circuit in ORCAD Capture, so we can look at how the controller responds with a non-ideal device. Once I'm happy with my design changes, I can easily integrate and configure the simulated piece by circuit block with the input module in MATLAB Simulink with just a couple clicks and run the simulation again. Here, we can see some differences between the target and actual rotor angular speed waveforms. The actual output shows some initial ringing and overshoot before stabilizing at 50. With the non-ideal device, the results are not as we expected, so we'll adjust the controller to address the instability and get the motor to its target rotational goal without overshooting or displaying strange behavior. I'll go ahead and add a 10 mega ohm resistor to the circuit based on my calculations from the new control loop. And with just a few clicks, I can easily configure the piece by circuit block and run the simulation again to see if the motor performance meets our goals. With seamless bi-directional integration between ORCAD PSPICE and MathWorks MATLAB Simulink, you can easily catch and fix issues in the design stage before they manifest in your prototypes.